Hi everybody! Welcome to Keyboard Games Book B. Today we're going to look at page 16, The Ghost. But first, let's sing the hello song. Hello, hello, come sing with me. Play with me and dance with me. We'll have lots of fun, you see. Making music together. I'm going to sing My Snowman. So we're going to do an interesting movement for this one. We're going to jump two times in the song. I'll show you where those jumps happen. And then in between, we're going to move our arms to the micro beats. So I'm going to show you one time through, just so you see what this will look like. You ready? Let's try it. Take a nice deep breath when we jump. Thank you. We're going to do some tonal patterns in minor tonality. Go ahead and just sing these after me. Thank you. I'm going to do jumping rope, which is our triple meter chant. So we're going to continue practicing this movement where we're swaying from side to side on our macro beats. And then we're going to pat our hands right in the middle of our bodies to the micro beats. Do da -de do, here we go. Ba 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 ba. Keep moving and echo after me. Ba ba ba. Ba ba ba. Ba 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 ba. Ba 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 ba. Ba 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 ba. Ba 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 ba. Thank you. I'm going to sing the boxer. Ba 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 Can you please move your arms like you're swimming through pudding? Think about how much you'd have to push to swim through pudding. Think about what that would feel like in your arms. Thank you for singing the resting tone. Beagle, we're going to move like we're pushing heavy boulders. So we're going to push ugh, heavy rocks. Here we go. things to get us ready for our piece that we're learning to play today, which is called the ghost. So I'm going to chant a chant and I would like for you to move very quietly like you're looking for a ghost. Here we go. 
This time I'm going to sing a song and I would like for you to bend yourself like you're a rubber ghost. Here we go. Bum, ba, bum, ba, bum, 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 ba, bum, 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 ba, bum, ba, bum, 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 ba, bum, ba, bum, bum, bum. We're going to do something. We're going to play air ball. So I'd like for you to imagine that you're catching a ball. But when you do, I want you to notice what it looks like from your hand to your elbow. It's going to be one straight line. So your hand isn't going to pull your arm, but when you're trying to catch that ball, your whole arm is going to move your hand with your wrist staying in one straight line. Remember, you don't want to try to catch a ball like that. That's not going to feel good in your hand. You're not going to be very strong. So let your arm move your hand. We're going to start by going slowly. I'm going to throw you a ball and I'd like you to catch it slowly. Make a small movement and catch it slowly. Let your arm move your hand. Here we go. Are you ready? Let's do it again. So try to catch that ball. You can catch it this way. You can catch it that way. You can catch it over here, but make sure your arm is moving your hand. Let's do it again. Now with that angle, the ball would have gone behind my head, but I'll throw it this way. Okay, let's go faster. So I'd like for you to make a bigger movement. See if you can catch it over this direction or over here, but let your arm move your hand. Ready? So I'm being you also, catching it on the other side. Let's do another one. Last one. Make sure your arm moves your hand. All right. I'm going to show you the way that your hand is going to move for the ghost. It moves like this. It's kind of an interesting movement. I'm going to sit here on the bench so that you can see what this movement would be like. So here's what it looks like. This is on, I'm imagining that the piano is this way. Here are my white keys. Here are my black keys. So I'm going to move one way and another way so you can see how this would be. So do, day, do, here I go. Do, day, do, day, do, day, do, day. Do, day, do, day, do, day, do. So what I'd like for you is to notice how the hand moves one way and then we're going to move the other way. So I'm going to do one movement, move one direction, and I'd like for you to do it with me. Make sure that just like in our air ball game, your arm moves your hand. Don't reach with your hand. All right, I'm going to do it, and then you do it. Here I go. Do day, do day. Do day, do day. Now we're going to move the other direction. Here I go. Do day, do day. Do day, do day. Now check this out. Hands going to move one direction and then the other. Do day, do day. Do day, do day. And then the last thing is it's going to go right in the middle and, oops, I moved my wrist, move the whole arm. Do day, do. Do day, do. I'm going to sing the melody of this piece so you can hear what this sounds like. Go ahead and move your hand or watch me move. Here we go. Do day, do day, do day, do day, do day, do day. Go ahead and 
tap your hand in one place and chant with me the ending. Do, day, do. Chant. Do, day, do. We'll come back and we'll do more with this a little later. Let's go ahead and review Are You Sleeping? This is our keyboard piece that we learned last time. So for Are You Sleeping, go ahead and find your S1 and your S2 keys. This is on page 15 in your keyboard games book B. So find your two keys, the S1 and then the S2, and the rhythm pattern is do, day, do, day, do, day, do, day. I'm going to have you play that with me, and I'll do the melody. Do, day, do, ready, play. Do, day, do, day, do, day, do, day, do. going to have you try the bass part. So this is low in the keyboard. You're going to play these white keys. If you haven't written them down, here's where they are. Notice they're right in between two, the two black keys and then right in between the two black keys. So not the lowest one, but the next two over on this side. So go ahead and find those. This hand is going to start with the left hand playing on do's goes like this do 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 get your hands ready see if you can play with me do do here we go with a partner or try singing the melody while you play or play with track 13 that goes with this book so you can experience playing this part and also this part while someone else is playing or singing the melody all right let's do a little bit more chanting we're going to do sunrise and we're going to move to our macro beats and micro beats just that same way that we were doing. All right, so here's our macro beat. It's kind of slow. So get ready for a slow macro beat. Do day do, here we go. Ba 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 Keep moving. And echo me, please. Ba ba ba. Ba ba ba. Ba ba ba. Ba ba ba. Ba 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 ba. Ba 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 ba. Ba 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 I'm going to sing the Royal Guards. I'd like for you to use your arms to explore all of the space on the sides, both sides of your body. So not in front of you, not behind you, but all of the space you can find at your sides. Here we go. Thank you. And let's do some tonal patterns. Sing after me, please. Bum, 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 bum,
Thank you. Let's go ahead and sit down. We are going to do our first improv activity for the day, which is animals. So I'd like for you to find and find a place on the piano that sounds like whatever animal you're thinking about. So take a moment and think about what type of animal you would like to do. I'm going to improvise about a blue whale. So decide what part of the piano, play some different keys, figure out what keys sound like a blue whale to you. Okay, so find your keys. Then I'd like for you to choose which rhythm pattern you're going to do. You have two choices. Your first rhythm pattern choice is do day do and you can play that one time or two times or three times however many times you want but your rhythm pattern would be do day do your other rhythm pattern choice would be do da di do it would be in triple meter so decide which one you want to do find your keys chant the rhythm pattern first and then improvise so i'll give you an example and then i'd like for you to do it so I think mine is do da di do. So go ahead and decide which rhythm pattern you're going to use, chant it, and then play it as many times as you want on those keys. Go ahead and pause the video and play. When you're practicing on your own this week, I would love for you to do this every day. So think about an animal, figure out what keys you want to use, and then choose do day do or do da di do and play that rhythm pattern however many times you want to make the sounds of your animal. In this case, it wasn't the sounds that a blue whale would make. I was thinking of sounds that would make me think of the blue whale swimming through the sea. So it doesn't have to be the sound that the animal would make. It could be something that shows what the animal would be doing. So have fun with that this week. We're going to do a little bit more singing. This is Welsh Corgi. <laughs> Can you please help me rock your whole body from side to side on the macro beats? Ba 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 ba, here we go. Bum ba ba bum ba ba ba, bum ba ba bum ba ba ba, bum ba ba bum ba 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 now we're going to do Fido. For this one, I'm going to sing something and I'd like for you to sing it. I'll sing the song and then I'm going to show you something cool with the song. All right, so. Reminder, here's what Fido sounds like. Now I can take those two notes that we sang at the beginning, and I can use those to make a harmony. For Fido. So here's what it could sound like. You can move however you'd like or you can just listen. Here I go. That's called a harmonization and doesn't it sound cool? You add something underneath the song and it makes it sound even more interesting. 
Um, um. Let's do Chihuahua. to sing the song and then I'm going to chant something and I'd like for you to chant it back. Chant after me. I'll sing again. And last one before we come back to the keyboard is swinging. I'd like for you to do your own dance for swinging. Thank you. All right. We're going to do one more improv activity before we come back over here and learn the ghost. So this improv activity is a rhythm pattern. I'm going to chant a rhythm pattern and I'd like for you to play it. You can use any keys that you want anywhere on the piano. Just play this rhythm pattern back. So you can play it on one key if you want, or you can play it on different keys. So I will chant it. You chant it and then play it on the piano. So if you want, you can get your hands set up somewhere. Do da di do, echo me please. Do ta da di do, do ta da di do, do ta da di do. Now you don't have to play the same thing that I'm doing, I'm just showing you when to play. Let's do another one. Do da di do, here I go. Do da ta di do, do da ta di do, do da ta di do. Another one. Here I go. Do da di ta do, do da di ta do, do da di ta do. Last one. Do ta da ta di do, do ta da ta di do, do ta da ta di do. All right, let's learn the ghost. So in your book, in your keyboard games book B, turn to page 16 and you're gonna see the three keys that you're going to use for this piece. You have those three keys. Now, we're going to use with your arm, remember we're moving the arm and hand together. The arm is actually going to move your hand. Your hand's not going to pull your arm along. Your arm is pushing your hand. Your arm is moving your hand from place to place. So we're going to use in and out movement going from a white piano key to a black piano key. Notice how this toward you and toward the piano. Go ahead and try this yourself. Going from a white key, a white key that's close to a black key. Now, try it on the other side. We're moving nice and slowly. Let's try to go faster. Now let's practice the last three notes of the song. It's this white key and we're going to play it with our chant. Here I go. Do, day, do. Do, day, do. 
And I'm going to play the entire piece so you can hear what it sounds like, and then we're going to do one section at a time. Do day do here I go. Do day 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 do. So let's practice the first part. We're moving to this key. So if this is your keyboard, you're moving this way to that black key. And we're going to chant do day do day. Go ahead and play that with me. Start on the white key. Play and chant with me. Do day do day. That's our first pattern. Our second pattern is going to go the other way. If this is your keyboard, you're going to go this way to that black key. Do day do day. Start on the white key. Play and chant. Do day, do day. That's our second pattern. Let's go ahead and play those two in a row. Pattern one and pattern two. So remember, we start by going this way. Do day, play with me. Do day, do day, do day, do day. Pattern three. We go in both directions. Do day, do day. So we start our first direction once, and then our second direction. Do day, do day. I'll sing it too, because I'm realizing that my voice is going the opposite direction, which might make it harder for you to hear. Do day, do day. Play with me. Do day, do day. And then our fourth pattern is do, day, do. Let's play those last two together. So this is starting from do, day, do, day. Start on the white key, play with me. Do, day, do, day, do, day, do. Let's play the whole thing. Start this way, two times, this way, two times. One, one, do, day, do. Here we go. Do day, 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 do day. I'm going to play a duet part with you. Do day, do play with me. try at home playing the ghost in different parts of the piano. Think about how it sounds. And if you like one of those sounds, if you like it and you want to show it to me, go ahead and show it to me when we have our check-in and tell me what you thought about it. Tell me how it sounds different to you in different places in the keyboard. All right, the last thing we're doing today is we're looking at Keyboard Games Book A. You always do something out of there. And we're going to play Old MacDonald on page 14. You've played the student part. We've practiced some melody. So now I want to show you the harmony. Remember how I was harmonizing Fido earlier? I was singing the harmony. Show you what it sounds like. And I'll show you the keys in just a minute. Bum, 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 here I go. So this is going to use, you're going to be playing this one. going to use. Go ahead and mark these down if you can. And I have these marked with solfege syllables. This one is do, so, 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 do, so
so and fa do so fa do is s one fa is s two and this is going to be two hands one hand's going to play do the other hands will play fa and so so i'm going to show you what this pattern sounds like bum, bum, bum. here i go in a fast so do at the end if you want to. So I'm going to play part of it and then I'd like for you to play part of it. So if you can find do, fa, and so. So we're going to start with do and fa. So the first pattern goes like this. Do, de, do, here I go. Do, do, fa, do. See if you can find those keys. Now I'll play, then you play. Here I go, do, do, fa, do, 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 fa, do. The second part sounds like this. Do, so, do. Find those keys. I'll play, then you play. Second part. Do, so, do, do, so, do. Now I'll play the two parts one after the other, and then see if you can play them both. Here I go. Do, do, fa, do, do, so, do. Do, do, fa, do, do, so, do. If you can, try to play those while I have the melody. Bum, 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 play with me. Do, do, fa, do, do, so. trouble with it, don't even worry about it, and now it's time for the goodbye song. Bye, bye, goodbye. Bye, bye, goodbye. What a shame we're ending today. Next time we will sing and play. Bye, bye, goodbye. Have a great day. Thank you. Bye.